Hello, people. How's it going? Hope all is well. Today, we are on F1 Manager 22, a brand new management game for Formula One, which is a lot of fun. It's like F1 22 meets Football Manager, and they combined. It's really in-depth, really awesome, and the graphics are incredible. Now, over on Twitch, we are doing a Mercedes series. We spun a wheel, and we decided to do Mercedes. So, if you want to see us play this live, we stream every Monday, Thursday, Friday, and Sunday over on Twitch. Go follow us. Uh, we do a really cool thing where you can choose your driver that you support. So, everyone has everyone focuses on one driver, either Lewis Hammond or George Russell, and they help us out with strategy and stuff like that. Obviously, today on YouTube, uh, I'm alone, so I'm in charge of all of it by myself which is rather scary. Uh, they have all of the different the teams, of course, and they start talking about them. For YouTube, we're going to do McLaren, McLaren, the team I support now. Episode one, I need your guys' help, of course. Daniel Ricciardo, that man right there, it got announced that in real life, he's leaving at the end of the season, which I'm, I'm happy and sad about. I'm happy because I feel like he wasn't doing great. We could go for a younger driver. I'm sad because I really, really, really like Daniel Ricciardo. So uh, in this episode, we're going to keep him for the first race in Bahrain. In the comments down below, do you want us to get rid of his contract now in the game and go a different route now, like real life? Or do we give him the benefit of the doubt, give him the season like real life and see if he can do better for us? Let me know in the comments down below. Keep Daniel Ricciardo or get rid of Daniel Ricciardo. You guys let me know. But we're going to be McLaren. Uh, the team rating is like three and a half. Season objective is fifth. Starting balance medium. Long-term objective is the Constructors Champion. Now, I've played a couple races, like I say. With Mercedes and McLaren, they're not great. Car performance is 8th of 10. Drive performance is 5th. Staff is 6th and headquarters is 4th. So they're not great. Uh, car 1 is apparently Ricardo, interesting. And our reserve is Stoffel Van Dorn. It's going to be a tough season. It's going to be very, very, very challenging. But we're going with McLaren, the team I support. And I'm happy. Harry 2, first time guidance. I'm going to disable because we've used that on Twitch. I think I'm good enough to disable that now. So let's go for it. It's an awesome game. Like I say, leave a thumbs up uh, on this video for a new series. It is hella in-depth. Really fun. Let me know how you want to do it as well. Do you want to do like the whole race weekend in each episode? Like, do you want to do practice qualifying and the race all in each episode? That's what we'll do for this episode. And then you guys can let me know. Or we can split them up, do quali, uh, practice and quality on one day, the race on another. I don't know. You guys let me know. But here we are in the main menu. Go over to our inbox. Welcome to the team, Harry. This is your new inbox. It's good to get... Uh, into the habit of checking your inbox regularly as you'll um, uh, get some important emails. Very nice. So there's our calendar. The circuits, of course. We have the race, cars, driver, our staff, our facilities. We have our board, our finances, and the standings. So first things first, we're going to design a new part to our car. So here are all of our stuff. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Obviously, again, you can watch us live on Twitch to get a full in-depth tutorial. We have the tutorial on on Twitch. So I've learned a bit on Twitch um, to help us out. So the up arrows here are crucial for the next circuit, which is Bahrain, and the up arrows are recommended. Um, and if we press E, we can see our top speed ranked 15. Low speed. I mean, we're not a far. We don't have a fast car. It's going to be very difficult. We're going to be battling a lot of like the midfield, like trying to get into Q3. Battling a lot for like 10th place, 9th place, stuff like that. We're not going to be on the podiums anytime soon. So it's going to be uh, it's going to be tricky. It's going to be tough. A good cornering. I think a good underfloor. A good underfloor might be crucial. So we're going to go underfloor. We have a certain amount of CFD hours. As you can see, we have 5.1 hours. We don't want to spend them all because they replenish every 56 days. So we'll use 0 0.5. Wind tunnel hours, we only have 68. We'll use 4. And that will get our speed up. And that will be a nice uh, a nice car. We're going to go for... This track is all about low-speed corners. So we'll focus on low-speed corners. Uh, we'll put two engineers on it. And we can rush it, but that'll take 1.5 mil. And we only have 25 mil here at McLaren. With Mercedes, we have like 140 mil. So I don't mind rushing a lot. So Daniel Ricciardo, uh, you can like... You get all the drivers' um, average and stuff. Growth potential low, aggression average... Um, so his contract is one year remaining. Uh, so if I would cost to break contract nine mil. So again, let me know if you want to get rid of him. It would cost nine mil to get rid of him. Um, and I mean, who would we, who would we even, uh, go for? Patience for negotiation. Very high. Open to negotiation. Of course, Piastri is there. Um, standard scout. 
Time to complete in 10 days is fine. PS3 is there, which is an obvious one, which looks to be the most realistic for real life. I think that's who... But yeah, you guys let me know. Right now we have Ricardo, and we're going to trust in him for Bahrain. Season kickoff party, improved driver morale, staff morale for 10k, we'll do it. Let's throw a party, baby. Right, post Bahrain. So we've done Bahrain testing. Uh, I see a lot of red. Uh, I don't think we're fast. I don't think we're fast. Growth potential high. 75 high growth potential for PS3 like we thought. So he could be a... He could be one that we look out for. Oscar PS3. He could be someone that we look out for. All right, performance targets. Reach Q2 with both drivers. See, it's even like we're going for Q2. Even that could be difficult. Uh, they want a fastest lap. We get that. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Right, let's go to race weekend. Episode 1, Bahrain. Leave your predictions in the comments down below. Again, if we can get any sort of points, I'll be happy. Because McLaren are not fast on this game at the beginning. The they have all the commentary, all the real voices, all the real radio messages. The game is in-depth as hell. And I think it'll be an awesome series. I really do. So for FP1, it's normally smart. So reserve drivers are the skilled alternatives to main drivers for race weekends. They can be sent out on track in P1, which is now, uh, to earn boosted experience and will pass on the car parts knowledge and self confidence to the main driver they're standing in for. So uh, it's always best to start with a reserve driver. We'll keep Lando as well. Um, and so this is your setup. So these blue bars, they'll get smaller as they learn the setup. And over here, they'll get feedback. So you want optimal. That's the best. Optimal, great. Uh, and they'll start to learn their setup. As they do more laps in practice. So let's go to practice one. Van Dorn. Look at they have cutscenes and everything. It is absolutely insane. We don't take up any space here in the middle as well. You can see everything. It's awesome. Send out Van Dorn. Send out Landon. So you get a broadcast camera. Like this. They have all the real licensing as well. They have a broadcast camera. You can ride on board with the driver. Have a look at that. You can see behind them. Look at the graphics. You have a shoulder cam, and you have a nose cam, and you can switch between the two drivers. So, um, uh, is it? So up here, you see zero out of five. This is um, their knowledge of the car. So they're going to go around a few laps. You can also speed up, so you could go two times, uh, four times, eight times, and 16 times, which is like this. So for practice, we'll just speed up it anyway. For the race, obviously, you're going to watch us on board. Uh, the leader, the tires, the sectors, last lap... It's so in-depth. I love it. Uh, so here you can see one out of five. So this is going to keep... There's yellow flags, red flags, there's crashes. Uh, there's everything. It's really in-depth. Uh, so when this gets to five out of five, we will see... Uh, we'll call them back in and we'll see how they like the car and how we can improve the setup. You want to get the best setup possible ready for qualifying and the race, of course. I like it because on Twitch we have Mercedes, which we're fighting for podiums in Red Bull. Mercedes are very fast. Bottas, by the way, is very fast in this game. I don't know why in the Alfa Romeo. I think they may need to patch it, but uh, Red Bull Ferrari are so fast. We're fighting for podiums on the cusp of podiums, but that's as good as we can get. Whereas with Ms. Uh, McLaren... Oh, see, it shows you replays too. For Latifi, he was going around, and oh, he lost it and went. So there are crashes. They always show you replays. It's awesome. Um, but yeah, with McLaren, it's going to be even harder. We're going for like P10, P9 at best, and we're fighting for like the real midfield. So it's going to be a real struggle. And he's got five now, so call him in. Uh, confidence is bad. So if we go here, we'll start to see... So, okay, so bad, 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 good. So you have to wiggle this about and try get it to where he likes it, basically. So it, you keep it in the blue, though. Uh, oh, I didn't want to use hard uh, soft tires. Use hards. I didn't want to use... Oh, that's my bad. Uh, I want to use hard tires because I, I, I want to keep the softs. Right, like that on hards. Let's go. So you have to reconfigure it. You send them out again, and they keep going. That's what uh, that's what practice is all about, you know? The card doesn't feel right. They have radio messages. It's awesome, man. It really... I did, like, again, let me know what you guys think in the comments. Maybe you guys are playing it. We also have a Discord that you can join in the description uh, where you can also talk about it. A bunch of people are playing it and talking about their series, and, uh, you know, they're doing all different teams. So feel free to get involved in the Discord as well. Uh, it is a lot of fun. I love it. We're playing it a lot on stream. We're going to be making a, a, a full series out of it. So I'm excited. I don't know how long the videos are going to be if we include practice, quality, and the race, though. Uh, because the races are quite long because it's a full race. Uh, Latifi ran wide. 
Um, so we'll see. Maybe we'll only include... Maybe we'll do, like, practice and quality in one episode, the race in one. We'll see. We'll but for today, we're going to do all of it in one because it's episode one and it's special. And then I'll leave a comment asking down below what you guys prefer. Right, we have, what, 16 minutes left. They can do some more. Again, go out on the same hard tires. Uh, okay, so we got a great... Right, try that instead. What about Van Dorn? He, okay, ooh, okay, okay. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Right, I think that looks decent. Go out again. Get as much as you can, boys. As much uh, knowledge as you can in the last 15 minutes. Because they're, they're worse drivers than, like, Mercedes, uh, you know, George Russell and Hamilton. It takes way longer for them to, uh, to get knowledge. It takes longer for our... Uh, pit crew to like change and stuff like that. It, 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 it's definitely different. Right, see if they can get some more knowledge. We have FP2 and FP3 as well. But get as much knowledge as we can. Right, check and flag. Oh, Stroll goes wild. That's the end of FP1. Let's see the confidence going into FP2. Right, send them out straight away. Let's see how Daniel Ricciardo does. Let's see. I love how all the drivers have their real radio, uh, like their real voices too. It's awesome. Let's see how Danny Rick is. Leclerc running wide. Eesh. Let's see the replay. And oof. You did it. Crofty did it. So Ricardo got. Jesus. Ricardo's got four out of five already. Whereas Norris is only one. So that's the experience, I think. That's the experience stat. If, if they have more experience, they get their setup knowledge way faster. As you can see, Ricardo, you want to get five out of five. Feeling good. He's already got five out of five. Norris is only on two. So. You can see the experience for Ricardo could come in handy. All right, FP2. Now, now it's been half an hour on two practice sessions. Um, I feel like maybe in future, either practice is done off camera or practice and qualifying are going to be one session. The race is going to be one. But for today, we're going to simulate uh, FP3 and hope they do well uh, in terms of their setup knowledge. 86%, 98%. Okay, not too shabby. Let's get to qualifying. So this is 86%. Now, we could change it a little bit and try to get that braking stability up like that. Uh, if we change it a little bit, it could become worse. He might like it less. Um, so it's a risk. As for Ricardo, uh, I mean, not much. Maybe like that. All of them are optimal. Just change that one a bit. Try to get another optimal. 98% is fine anyway. That is fine. That is perfect. Let's go to qualifying. Oh, Ferrari got... No, they both went together. Good, good, good. They both went together. So, Q1, top 15 cars. Go through to Q2. And let's hope we are one of them. Oh, Norris actually got in front of Ricardo. Right, so we are on board with... Uh, Lando Norris. Oh, no, Ricardo's in front now. Okay, so let's see Ricardo's lap then. Daniel Ricardo. For McLaren. You can see their sector times down here. Gets past the Alpine. It's on his outlap. Come on, boys. We need some good times. We're one of the first cars out. A bit of traffic. You don't want to get sent out in traffic. Couple cars up ahead, which is not great. And the Aston Martin is going to hold Ricardo up a little bit. He just squeaks through. Uh, Norris also gets past, but it's run wide. That Aston Martin was not great to us. There, I'll be honest with you. Not great to us. Ricardo comes in. Uh, only six tenths off the leader, Leclerc. Driver setup knowledge, 92. We can't change anymore in Park Ferme. Eh? Uh, you can just uh, change the wings, but... He has 92 now. That's fine. We'll go on fresh because I think for the race, we're going to do like medium to hard anyway. Or hard to medium. So we'll go on fresh tires. And Norris now. Rumpler. Oh, I hate when it doesn't let me do it. Reconfig. Oh, I wanted to send them out together. I made that mistake before as well. Right. Send them out. Send them out. Send them out. Send them out. Right. They're, 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 they're together. They, he can get that toe, hopefully. And hopefully everyone else goes in. They do. We have the track to ourselves. On board with Daniel Ricciardo. The whole track to ourselves for our flying lap. We're currently P12 and P13, so we're currently safe, but it's important to get this one more lap time in. I don't. I think this might be our last lap, to be honest. I don't think we're going to do this lap plus a cooldown. He goes green in sector one. So does Norris. So they're going faster. They are going faster. There goes everyone else. Green sector two. Ricardo comes in. 
Up to only up to P12 Norris. P11. Oh, we may not be safe with everyone else going in now. Let's just push this car for one more lap. Because okay. we're going to make it past the checkered flag. So let's push the car all out and try have one more storm a lap. We might as well. I know we need to refuel. I know, I know. Just go, just go, just go. See if we can finish. If we can't finish that, we can't finish it. But Ocon's finished. We might be safe. Sunoda's finished. The top three are finished. Ricardo is currently P14. Oh my god, he retired right before the line. He retired right before the line. Well, we make it anyway. P P12 and P14. Jesus, Norris. Well, we made it to Q2. Um, oh my god, because his car retired. He doesn't get to do in Q2. Wow, Norris getting screwed over in the first race of the season. I can't believe it. That was a set of scrub tires. He's, what, 2.7 seconds off. I can't, but I feel bad for Norris, man. Right, wait for the traffic. Go for one more run. I can't believe that, honestly. Got to go out as the other cars are coming in. Get a clean lap. Please go out. Beat him, beat them, beat them, beat them. Lovely. Okay, clean lap for Ricardo. Let's go. P10. Oh, he's going out. Russell, I mean, all of these are going to go faster. There's no chance. Start, yeah. And none of us make it. The Q3 was done, what, 13 and 15, I think. 13 and 15. We got screwed heavily there. God damn it. Going to be tough to get points in this one. Welcome to right, the strat. The strat we're thinking. Mediums to hards. Um, Go to lap 26. Mediums to hards. We're one stop. That's the optimal pit stop. We're one stopping. Uh, and Norris, should we, should we reverse it? Go hard to mediums, maybe? It's the same. They're just swapped. Mediums to hards, hard to mediums. I think that's what we go for. So they're on different strategies. Ay, ay, ay. Let's do this. Bahrain, let me know in the comments down below where you think we're going to finish. It's five lights on. I'll let Crofty take it away. It's lights out, and away we go. Right, then on board with Daniel Ricciardo. For, actually, we'll go to Norris because he's behind. And let's see what we can do. Use our overtake lap one as well. Let's try and get some overtakes, boys. Here's the leaderboard, of course. Norris already down to 16. What tires are other people on? Oh, people are actually starting on softs. Okay, so Norris might be slow at the beginning. But hopefully by the end, hopefully by the end, he will uh, he will be catching up. Because he's going longer. If we can get some points, I'll be happy, you know? If we can get some points, I will be happy. But it's going to be tough. We're on different strategies. Of course, Norris on the hard tires going way longer than everyone else. So, hopefully, next to Yuki Tsunoda. Norris on the outside of Sebastian Vettel. Not quite, though. Again, he's getting close to the Aston Martin on softs. Maybe down this main straight here. Maybe down this main straight. He's on deploy ERS. Go, 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 go. No DRS yet, of course. Going, 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 going. And just going to... No, he's going to go for it. Landon Norris gets the place back. Up to P15. Daniel Ricciardo has heard what Norris done. He's going to try to do the same on Yuki Sonoda down the main straight, maybe. DRS is enabled. enabled. And now with DRS, uh, which we don't have yet, so weirdly enough. Ricardo has taken Yuki. Now two seconds off K-Mag. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Lovely. Right, start harvesting your ERS now. Start harvesting that ERS. Oh, Yuki's got him back with the DRS. Yuki's got him back. And it looks like K-Mag, uh, Mick Schumacher, sorry, also going to try to make a move. As we are harvesting our ERS. Also going to try and make a move on Daniel Ricciardo. And I think he's going to get him. No, down the main straight. Ricciardo holds him off. Norris is involved as well. With Ricciardo, the DRS open of the Haas. Norris should have DRS as well in this little train. We're going to wait for our ERS to get to 100. And we're going to use it all again. Uh, Vettel is four seconds off Norris. So Norris is clear behind. We just need to catch up to the cars in front. And hopefully try to get some points. There's a little train up ahead. Going all the way up to P7, which is exciting. You can watch any car as well, by the way, which I think is awesome. You can literally spectate any car. Ricardo overtakes Yuki. Ricardo clear up in P11. Now, let's go, baby. Cut. There's, the, there's the rest of the train. Let's go, Rick. Let's go, Rick. Oh, and keep going. Four seconds off uh, uh, K-Mag, sorry. But he's getting pressure from behind. Who knows going to take it back? They're going to keep rotating, I think. They're going to keep rotating. Right, you need to start conserving your fuel now, I just realized. Jesus Christ. In the DRS with Mick Schumacher. Just not fast enough. Ricardo has Tsunoda again. Lovely. Just need to stick with them. And here comes Yuki again. Down the side. And the Haas getting involved too. 
Mick Schumacher took advantage there. Because we slowed down. He took advantage. And absolutely stormed us. Bang. And he's used our foot fuel to take Mick again. A lot of overtaking happening. Norris just can't get Tsunoda. Ricardo's good at, to be fair, he's always been good at overtaking. Uh, Norris just can't get involved with them right now. He has a hard tyres, maybe that's why. He's on the slower tyre, you know. Oh, no, there we go, Norris. There we go. Oh, no, see? He goes for it, but then pulls out. Right there with Mick again. It's just overtaking galore. And as we're fighting, this little train here on the map is getting away. We need to catch up to this train. Oh, sector 2. Yellow flag in Sector 2. Latifi locks up. Ricardo will overtake. Hopefully, he wasn't in the Sector 2. We'll watch the replay. Lati of course, it's Latifi locked up. And goes off, silly Billy. What's everyone starting? See, they're on 60% because these are fighting. We're on 80% right now. So, we're going way longer. This could be good. You can push these tires a bit, actually. You need to get away, but we're not going to. He's right there again. Norris still there. We just can't escape them. You know, we overtake them. We just can't escape them. Nine laps gone of 57. We need to catch up to this next train with K-Mag. Another yellow sector. Sector 2 yellow flag. Someone's gone off again, it looks like. Verstappen. Let's take a look Max at Verstappen. Now here we see Max As Verstappen. they're all battling at the front. Locks up and goes You're off. Costly. Yellow sector 2. Don't matter for Ricardo. He loves overtaking there. Boss locked up. Good. Don't like Boss. He's annoying in our Mercedes series on Twitch. Right. Now go. See? 1.8. Good. He's got rid of him. Ricardo's clear behind. No DRS behind. Now focus on K-Mag in front. And Norris, you focus on taking these two. Magnussen locked up. Good. Hopefully Ricardo can catch up to him. Norris has taken both Yuki and Mick. But for how long? They're resting their battery right now too. Yeah, he's going to drop back down to both of them. He can't keep with them. Alpha Tower, he, he can't the do it. Ricardo three seconds off now. He just can't keep in front. K-Mag's out of that train now too, you can see. K-Mag's away from these, so... Tsunoda back in DRS of Ricardo now. Not ideal. Not ideal. Steins pits. Steins is the first to pit. Yuki Tsunoda right on our tail. How have these all caught? How have we let these all caught catch up, man? How have we let them all catch up? Honestly. I mean, they're on soft tires. There goes Yuki. Ricardo, four seconds off. A lot of people peeing around us. We're currently 10 and 11, boys. 10 and 11. I don't really want our two cars fighting. Use each other to drag each other along. Norris takes Ricardo. If Norris is the faster car, even on hards, let him go. I don't care. Let him go. Everyone pitting. DRS drain. Right. Conserve it. Conserve it. P5 and 6. Norris back in front. Of okay, I don't like that they're fighting, though. Look, they're fighting. Right, Norris. We're going longer. Don't fight. Don't fight, teammate. We're going longer. Just let him go. Let him go. Let him just stay in each other's DRS. Stay in DRS. Don't fight him. People go down to medium, so they're going to be doing a two-stop. Soft, medium, then one more. Norris, I said don't fight. I said don't fight your teammate. You're going to let Hamilton get you now. God damn it. Yeah, there he goes. There he goes. I mean, we're not really racing Hamilton anyway, but it's still annoying. And now he's going to take Ricardo again. We're not racing him, so it's fine. We're not racing uh, Hamilton anyway, so it's fine. Boys, just stay in each other's DRS and carry each other. Both getting DRS right now with Hamilton. Just stay with him, boys. Just stay with him. Ricardo's going for it, you know. Ricardo's going for it. He just overtook Hamilton. On fresh hards. He just took him. Ay, ay, ay. What a race. Go on, Lewis. But now Ricardo gets no uh, DRS. But Hamilton will take him back, obviously. Norris, stay within DRS. Hamilton going to get him on the main straight? No. We're actually holding up with the Mercedes right now. We are holding up with the Mercedes. Right, Hamilton back in front like I thought. All got DRS again. Norris takes for it. Oh, they're fighting. They're fighting. Right. So this is our pit strategy, our pit window. The green is our optimal lap. So we're going to wait for that. Look, wheel to wheel. Why are we fighting? Why are we fighting? Right, Norris wants to go. Ricardo, don't fight, teammate. You're going to be pit first anyway. Don't fight. Swap position. No, don't please. swap. You're already in front. Yep, just don't it. fight. Just don't fight. We can stay within DRS of Hamilton and just drag ourselves forward. That's all we need to do, boys. Hamilton's taken... Norris took Ham... We're actually racing the Mercedes. I don't want to be. But we are actually fast enough to, like, overtake them, re-overtake them with a the DRS. Ricardo's going for it as well. Alonso, Bottas, and Russell getting involved behind us soon, though. It's going to start getting tech in. Of course, we still have to pit, obviously. Actually, Ricardo, you're going to pit this lap, I think. Because I think next lap is going to be optimal. 
So, uh, stay on neutral for now. And push these tires. Norris, you're not pinned, so you can use your ERS. And Ricardo, when you come out... Norris takes him again. You're going to have a blistering outlap. Ricardo. Oh, Norris is going. Optimal, right? Box confirmed. Box confirmed. Lovely. Uh, in your in lap, you may as well attack then. Let's try and push up. You may as well attack those tyres. Okay, understood. Norris got Hamilton out of his DRS. Okay, use the Ricardo is going to take good. Lewis Hamilton around the outside, and Ricardo takes Hamilton. <laughs> Yo, this McLaren, maybe we do have some speed in us. Oh my goodness. You've done well, Danny Rick. You've done well. Go into the pit stops. You've done very well, lad. Ricardo drops into the pits. Gasly's going to go. Joe is going to go. Is he going to stay? No, k Max going to go. He's going to stay in front of Yuki, who is fine before he comes out. Just in front of Yuki. Norris. Gets taken again. I thought he would soon. As he's harvesting. Just stay within DRS, my friend. Right, now push your fuel. Go Aggie. And catch up to Mag, my friend. Catch up to Mag. Come on. Norris pit window opening in one lap's time. Oh, get in DRS. Get in DRS. Oh, Bottas is here as well now. Bottas is here as well. Norris held up Ricardo Hamilton for so long. Was battling, but now Alonso and Russ, they're all coming. They're all coming. Our hard tyres are 35%. Uh, we pushed them quite a lot. Might have to pit before his optimal, to be honest. Everyone's getting involved. Well, I mean, we're not really racing these guys, like I say, but use them for DRS, my friend. In comes Lando Norris for his stop then. Gasly's going. Joe's going to go. Here comes K-Mag. 2.7 seconds. Where's he going to come out with Ricardo? Ricardo, go. Ooh, Norris. A bit behind. The car's in front. Got some catching up to do, my friend. Use that overtake. Oh, there goes Lando Norris. Flying past Danny Rick. Oh, he's still on Don't Fight Teammate. That might have slowed him down a bit there. God damn it. He's on the... Oh, he's on hards, dude. Norris is on mediums, to be fair. Maybe we let Norris have a crack at them, eh? Maybe we let Norris have a crack. Now it's just going to be our two cars fighting. It's going to be our two cars fighting, boys. Ricardo takes him again. And now Norris is way off because they were fighting. There we go, 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 there we go. There's one. There's one. Bloody attack them. Bloody attack them. Down the main straight. Someone else pits. Two people pit. Get Mick as well. Break in late, Norris. Took him. Lovely. We need you to catch up now as well. Need you to get back in DRS because you've fallen off a bit now. Need to help Norris. Mick's going to take him again. More people pitting. Of course, everyone else is going to have to pit. Whereas we're staying on these tyres till the end. Norris. Nah, no chance. Not yet. Right, they all pit again. We're in front of Mick. Four seconds off Alonso. Currently running P9. Oh, there's Mick though. 39 percent Okay, he's going to pit again. Uh, Alonso's already pit. Those hard runners, I think that's their last tyre. Oh, we're just, it's just back and forth. It's a seesaw. It's a damn seesaw with him. Ocon locked up. Good. Oh, Ocon's nowhere near us. Never mind. Ricardo now fighting against Gasly. Norris finally in some clean air in the top 10. Six seconds off Alonso. Finally in some clean air. Danny Rick, we're going to need you to... Uh... What do you do there? Joe overtakes Ricardo. Oh, Ricardo. We just don't have that speed in the McLaren, you know? We just do not have that speed. There's not much we can do. I did say it'll be a lot of battling for the midfield this season. There goes Gasly. Uh, where any points are big, you know, even if you get a P10 or P9, that's massive. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Let's see if we can stay within his DRS, boys. Let's see if we can stay with him. Behind Joe. Norris in that DRS train. With Russell right in front. Gasly right behind. Gasly's taking Russell. This little DRS train is getting heated. Rick uh, Norris, you need to stay with them, though. He's out of DRS. He's out of DRS. The safety cars or virtual safety cars. Just a couple of yellow flags here and there. Start using that ERS, boys. Start using that ERS. Seven laps, one aggressive on our tyres. Come on, Norris. We all believe in you, lad. We all believe in you. Oh, see, they're battling. Which slows them down. Joe Ricardo are battling. Oh, I think it's done, boys. I don't think we can get them. I think we might just have to... Oh, Joe's gaining. Oh, we're out of DRS. I think P10 is as best we can do right now, unfortunately. Yeah, they're leaving us. 
They've left us. Now that we're out of DRS, they've left us. They've left us. Uh, they've left us. Four laps to go, boys. Come on. Joe is right behind Norris now. Right behind Norris. And we're trying to conserve our tires just to finish this race. Oh, we're all in the last lap. We're going to lose our points on the last lap. I can feel it. But I don't think he can defend that much. Oh, not on the last lap, boys. Joe's taking him. And we've actually lost points on the final lap of the race. First place is taking their finishing. I mean, Norris, you're right there, lad. You're right there, mate. Final straight attack. Nah, done. Ah, P11 and P12 in our first race of the season, ladies and gentlemen. Again, that's where we're expected. Mid-grid is like I said, you know. That's where we're expected. Battling, trying to get those one or two points. Unfor we literally lost a point in the last lap, which is unf unfortunate. Norris got screwed in uh, qualifying anyway, but Ferrari won two, three, four points is up there. Uh, George Russell is in eighth. And Joe takes the final point a second he could. Ladies and gentlemen, that has been a rather long episode number one of our F1 Manager 22 McLaren career mode. Again, this is all going to be in episode one. And then maybe in episode two, we'll split it. So we'll have practice and qualifying in one uh, episode and then the race in another. Or we'll do practice off camera and just have the episodes be qualifying the race. But I think because the race are so long, having them separate might be better. So maybe this could be our weekend series like every Saturday and Sunday we we'll see but that is going to be it from me today hopefully you have enjoyed if you have please do leave a big thumbs up on the video remember to follow us on twitch link in the description down below uh, where we have a mercedes career mode and we also have a discord under twitter down there too uh, let me know in the comments down below do you want to get rid of daniel ricardo he done all right to be fair or do you want to keep him for half of the season i've been out to be awesome as we skin what a long episode one this is going to be much of always take care and peace see the truth. I never want us to burn out I never want us to burn out